going to do a collection video for our friend Danielle in Falcon, Colorado. So normal people have a dresser or a TV stand. Well, my parents have a snake rack. So this is where we keep our adult ball python. Here's an example. Uh, this is Memorial. She's a female Mojave. She's about to shed. You can see I mean, she has blue eyes. And then we have the cards because so we don't so when we scan them on our phone, they we tell them when we um bat bathe them or clean out their cage or fed them or when they didn't eat or did eat. This is on the card. So if you don't have reptile scan, you should get it. The link's down in the description. Okay. Here's where we keep our snake skin and stuff. We keep these for projects. And we have like almost all of our snake skin. When they're perfect, we keep them. When they're not, we don't. Here's our... Fire X O skeleton. So this is just the top row of our supplies. See it? This is the stuff where we build it in. This is to the spider, just it's way too big. This is the shedding and I don't know what this is. For Mickey Light. It's for Mickey Light. Now I'm gonna show you something. That hasn't been done. No, I'm just joking. These are where we keep our eggs. Our, our dad uh, turned it into a heat cooler. The waters make it stay, the heat stay in there. Here's where the baby snakes are going to live after they hatch. My daddy built all of these. He built this to this. Now we're going to look at the juvenile snake rack. Here's where we keep our juvenile snakes. The smallest is on the top and the biggest is on the bottom. We have the same cards like in there for the juvenile. Here we are in the girls room where we keep our rack necks. We got our rose hair. And we got a versatile color. Okay, Danielle, I hope you enjoyed our um, collection. And you maybe want, might want to get Lily and Emily a snake for Christmas. Because that's what good mommies do. And Jason a chinchilla. Comment, like, subscribe. See, See you next time! time.